Design space has been such a pain recently, but I found a solution. Over on the Cricut Help website, there's an article explaining that if you clear the cache, cache? Cache. Cache. It will solve the problems until their software engineers come up with a permanent solution. Now, I read the instructions and my head basically exploded and I thought, there's no way I'm doing that because if I do, I'll wipe my hard disk, the computer will explode and I'll never craft again. Then, of course, I came back to reality and I figured, you know what, this cannot be that hard and I should at least give it a try. So I decided I'm going to try and I'm going to film it so we can do this together and so we can all stop being so frustrated with design space crashing on us all the time. Now, I know the article says there's a permanent solution on the way, but you know, we've all been experiencing these problems after a software update. So who knows what might happen after the next one? So I think it's a great idea for us to get our heads around clearing the cache so that if there ever is a problem in the future, we know what to do. And you might want to save this video so you can come back and watch it again to see how we cleared the cache, because obviously none of us is going to remember how we did this. Okay, here we go. Let's get started trying doing this. I'm gonna open the instructions for myself on my phone so I can see them whilst I'm doing everything on the computer. But for you guys, I will put the instructions up in the video as I'm doing them and I'll also link the article I'm following in the description below. Okay guys, here we go. The first step I'm doing this on a Mac is confirm design space for desktop is closed. Okay, so... Nope, need to close it. Quit, quick at design space. Are you sure you want to quit? Yes. Right now, open the terminal, go to Finder. I'm gonna do this once about that. Finder. And then it said applications, utilities. Uh-huh, utilities, terminal. Ah, got it. Okay. Write in the command defaults write com dot apple finder apple show all files, yes. I'm just going to copy and paste this. Command C, terminal, command V. Okay, now close the terminal. Press and hold the option and control key. Option control. Click on finder in the dock and select relaunch. Oh look, there's all these funny files that have appeared on my desktop. Uh, okay, click on my hard disk, select users, select your user account name, open the Cricut design space folder, open local data, select all files within the local data and drag them to the trash and empty the trash. I'm just gonna Hit move to bin and then I will empty my bin. Launch design space for desktop. Okay. And then force reload the application. It's just reloading, let's see. Oh great, it's downloading an update. Let's see how long this takes. Much, much, much later. Oh, okay, finally it's done. Right, so I had to relaunch and then it said something about Force reload the application, select view in the top left hand corner and select force reload. This should resolve the issue. Let's put it to the test guys. I'm going to start a new project and I'm going to just load it up with images and just loads of layers and see what happens. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one, that one. Insert images. Okay, it's loading, it's loading. Okay, that's worked. Seems to be fine, no issues. Okay, let's try adding some text. Let's see if we can change the font. Yeah, I mean, guys, it seems like this has worked. I'm gonna try and upload one of my previous projects that I know is a bit heavy lifting. Yeah, guys, I think that clearing the cache actually has worked. That is really cool. 
How awesome, guys. We cleared the cache, we did it together, and it worked. Design space is functioning much better for me now. Let me know if this worked for you in the comments. I'd love to hear from you guys. And guys, if you are struggling with design space and just generally getting to grips with it, then check out my Cricut Essentials playlist, which I will put on the screen for you. It is packed full of beginner-friendly videos on just the basics of how to do certain things in design space. So go ahead and check that out. Guys, can't wait to see you in the next video. Until then, happy crafting!